Hey everybody, how's it going? Welcome to part two of the Mario Wonder Let's Play. So in this part, we're going to finish this world, I believe. Wonder Token Tunes. Well, break time! Uh, yeah, oh yeah, this is a minigame, never mind. So like, in, so like in Sonic Superstars, there is no lives in this game either, which is, uh, which, which is kind of weird, but oh, whatever. And this is a shop. So now I have a brain fart here. You, so that there's a badge that we're highlighting, and or that we were just highlighting, but I didn't register it as a badge, so... I don't get it right now. I get it later. At the moment, I just felt that like, nah, I don't need any of these. Whatever. Just press and just press and hold Y. <laughs> Flattering picture of you, Peach. Hey, maybe it's time to change too. Hi, I'm Daisy. coming through wait why am i here oh yeah okay never mind yeah that was a brain fart i was like no wait no i've done this <laughs> that's literally what i was thinking so much like mario 3d world we need to collect oh so many of these wonder seeds so we can progress the game in Mario 3D World, you have to collect green coins. No, wait, green stars. Sorry. The Wiggler Race. Yeah. We just have to race this jerk of a Wiggler, which is fine. Just so we can get a better, uh, a better start. Wow. Oh, I gotta like the Wiggler... How, you know, you gotta like how the wiggler's on roller skates or roller blades. This also sucks because it's a race, but yet he can't be hit by any of the enemies. We can. How is that fair in a race? I just tr treat this like the gourmet race and... Kirby Superstar. <laughs> that skedaddlers will probably like, oh thank god, she's gone. <laughs> what the hell, you stupid wiggler? <laughs> How do you go through, th through met, through, th th through metamorphosis and, be and flutter off? Oh, bad joke. Wigglers become flutters. Yeah. We did it! Oh, -ho. Wiggler race it! It was a piece of cake! Now, I'm not too sure if uh, the voices of if Peach, or if the voice of Peach is 
different. Daisy sounds like Daisy, so. All right, we'll deal with that in a bit. Ah, uh, badge, a, a challenge. Wall jumping. This threw me. Oh yeah, no, it's a wall climb jump. Wow, I can't believe that when I was playing this, I brain farted. So, and just write it as wall jump because we naturally have the wall jump. But the wall, the wall climb, is as it looks. You attach yourself to a wall and then you jump up, up at least once. And when you try again, you'll do, just do a wall jump. So. Now, there's a good chance in this Let's Play, I will probably use Daisy a lot. Not because I'm a big fan of her. It's more because this is her first mainline game, appearance-wise, since Mario Land. And it's also her first playable appearance in a Mario, you know, in a mainline game, so. Don't get wrong, I like Daisy. I don't think there's any character in the Mario franchise that I dislike. It's either I like them or they're fine. I'm just checking out all the stages here, so figuring out what I want, what it is I want to do. Angry spikes and sinking pipes. All right, let's do it then. Ah, fire! Did 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 Daisy. Even though it's quite obvious what a character would look like if they got a fire flower, it's, it's still neat to see. To see happening. It's like, we all know that because their overalls, your clothes become white and you're. And. Well, and for Mario and Luigi. Well, well for Mario and Luigi's case, their overalls uh, become the color that they typically wear and. And then. And then their shirts and hats become white. Or as Peach and Daisy, their dresses become dominantly white, but then parts of um, remain the colors that they typically are, or become the color, the lighter shades. Yeah, at this point, I was still looking around for the coins. Yeah, there you go. If, if you need to know where a 1-Up is, there you go. Spikes are jerks. I like how I didn't get the coin on either side. Also, yeah, I did that because well, I didn't want to lose my elephant power up. some coins up there. There we 
go. Now, I don't think you see this happen in my playthrough, but this pipe over here, here, here at the flower that just went down, take it all the way down off screen. Why were you living underground? Don't flowers need sun? Eh, yeah, whatever. Well, I guess I'm trying again. See, this is why I don't... Why going forward I don't really care enough to find specific things, but I guess I want that Wonder Seed. It would have been funny if that spike ball that he just threw yeah, killed him. I'm wondering if... So yeah, because these, pi these pipes have, like, sludge or something on them. I was wondering if there was something I needed to do. More so with the princesses, uh, because uh, it's the crowns. Uh, this power makes me think of Babar. Yeah. No, don't go in there. Ow. Spike ball beats water. But trunk beats spike ball. That was close. Crap, I lost my elephant. Whatever. Oh, wait, no. Never mind. Durr. There's nothing I can do with that. I need a shell or something. Pretty sure I didn't record it. Uh, come on, past me. Okay, 
your first instinct is to think that it's death. Yeah, I was like, screw it. So you're on a time limit here. And depending on your time will determine the amount of uh, coins you'll get at the end. What you gonna go with? To be fair, it's probably better to go for the... Uh, it's better to use the fire flower. Funny, I do like uh, the Goomba's reactions more so when you jump over them. I'm just gonna like what? <laughs> I came back here later and rectified my uh, performance. With these guys, it's just better to grab their attention. Coming up in three, two, one. All the Boros guys are like, well, we're down here. What do we do now? The last one. I hit her. Yeah, so if I got a faster time, I could have gotten all three at once. For now, I decided to well, switch to Yellow Toad. that you can push those the warp pipes and 
that pipe there that we just passed, you can put that one that was pushed, you can push it onto that pipe I tried to go down. And then you can go down that pipe. Yeah. The way they came out, I was expecting them to come back down, but okay. Snails are the only enemies that can survive going in there. All right, so now we got the uh, worm pipes again. There's a time limit on on these wonder flowers or whatever the hell they're called. Or if they just go until you till until you get the wonder seed. If anyone else knows, let me know. Though there's a chance when I do more sessions on this game, I will probably find out. <laughs> Was it all a dream? Dope. Yeah. Funny, um, when the toads are in the elephant form, I think of Taj from <laughs> from Diddy Kong Racing. stage. I like how they both have such hard heads that when one charged the other, they both got dazed. <laughs> Just, uh... <laughs> about these uh, blue coins. They're, they're just ex extra coins. You don't have to worry about getting all of them. However, the nice thing is, also in this game, if you die... Actually, I better con confirm before I... before I be it, before I, li before I potentially lie. Is this shiver to ride them? Okay, yeah. So if you die in a stage after, and you've grabbed the uh, per large purple coin, you get to keep it. I don't know, I was trying to land right there. Whatever. Though to be fair, you don't have to to 
wait to land on those guys to get across. You can actually just literally jump across. Um, the poisonous liquid does not uh, come reach you. They definitely want you to come back here with an elephant power up. I guess with that will be the end of part two. Until then, you all take care.